What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel, or welcome to the channel if you're new here. We're back on Elden Ring, and uh, this is like the third time I'm recording this intro. The only reason I've had to record this intro, the amount of times that I have, is because I'm trying to kind of get rid of the recap thing. Everyone has seen like the progression and bosses and stuff in this game already, so I feel like it's not really necessary to recap it. Alright, so first things first, we're gonna go to the manor and I'm gonna kill Rikard. I mean, it's just not even fair for these enemies, man. Oof. Ow. Mm. Look at that, phase two already. Or at least super phase. Ah! Ah! Got him. I uh, just quickly want to thank you all for the support on the previous Elden Ring part. And if you enjoy these videos, then consider hitting the like button and the subscribe button. And secondarily, is that even a word? And also hit the bell notification icon. Because I know some of you definitely aren't getting my notifications. And if you're new, you might want those notifications. You guys don't mind if I cheese Riker, do you? <laughs> Saw this trick a while back and it actually works really well. Oh yeah, yep. Still big damage. Um, so to kind of explain this, the reason why it's doing so much damage is not just because I'm power stancing the weapons, but since I have the uh, Serpent Hunter in my right hand, hopefully that made sense. <laughs> Oh, here comes the Rancor, so... Yeah, that's not fun. Ow! Oh! I think he's starting the Rancor. I got him, though. Alright, the Draconic Sentinel. Possibly the easiest enemy in the game with a strength build. I mean, come on. Ow. Alright, enough. No! Let this be a lesson. Don't talk trash until after you've beat the boss. Alright, let's see if a tree can handle my strength. Alright, Godfrey. This Godfrey specifically has possibly one of the best boss tracks in the game. Ooh. And down goes Godfrey. And by the way, I know it was a little scuffed last part, but here's the setup. Don't worry about the arrows. They're just kind of there. Mm. Oh, I already lost my uh, buff. Okay. I get that move confused with the other spear move, because he has two for some reason. Whoop. Oh, that damage is crazy! No. Oh. Alright, well. What do you guys say we go and fight Nial and then get to Halig Tree? <laughs> so I think in this part, we'll go and kill Nial, and depending on how much recording time is left, then I'll go and kill like one or two of the miscellaneous achievement bosses, and then, you know, one the part there. Um, and if not, then I'll just end the part when I get the second piece of the medallion. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's big damage. But he hits even harder. Ah! Oh, hold on. Wait. Wait. 
Castle Soul. I remember this place for two reasons. Randomizer Melania, and obviously Commander Nial. Freaking snitch in a cage. All right, you weren't supposed to do that yet, but you know what, whatever. Like that. If you just get rid of that guy immediately, the fight is extremely easy. Ow. Please don't hit me, please don't hit me. Oh. I have to constantly look over to my OBS to see exactly where the boss's health is at because my mic is in the way. All right, here we go. Phase two. Eh, no. Ow. And then boom, and then, yep. Boom. Mm. All right, just not enough stamina. Ha! There we go. I have eight veterans prosthesis, so I have killed him in every single run. What's weird about that though, I haven't killed Melania eight times. Melania is just one of those bosses that you fight the first time and then forget about it in every single other playthrough. Thanks for the medallion piece. I'm gonna ask this question. I wanna see, what is your favorite area in Elden Ring? Just gonna throw that question out there. No further commentary on that. We're not going to talk about how I got this second piece. Alright, I'm going to be honest. I have no idea how long this video is going to be. It's probably going to be on the shorter side. Uh, I'm going to cut it short. Uh, I think next part we'll go and kill a bunch of the um, non-main achievement bosses. And then in part 4 we're going to try and kill Melania. Get through Halig Tree and all that stuff. And then part 5 should be the finale. So, yeah. So if you have enjoyed today's part... Consider hitting the like button and subscribe button, and obviously hit the bell notification icon so you get notified whenever I post new videos, because I know some of you aren't getting notified. Thanks for watching, everybody. I gotta go. Stay cool. Peace out, people.